And since 2019, Zukunft Tanzt is creating space for artists of all ages that see themselves at the beginning of their choreographic career. The festival combines artistic development, knowledge transfer, presentations and um, networking, and hereby focusing on the needs and the potential of these young choreographers. My name is Laurin Thomas and this is Ida Kaufmann. And we are both responsible for the organization, the management and the curation of the Festival Zukunft Tanzt since 2019. In the past four years, the festival has developed from a presentational structure for short pieces on a shared evening to a two-week format with workshops, residencies, work in progress showings and professional training. Over the two weeks, the festival was accompanied by professional training in the frame of Tanzplattform Rhein-Main, open to the participants and to dance professionals from Frankfurt and the region, led by Laura Hicks, a graduate of the Master for Contemporary Dance Education program and a freelance choreographer and dancer based in Frankfurt. For three groups, a one-week residency was serving as intensive final rehearsals at the Artist House Musanturm and Z Center for Rehearsals and Research, supported by the mentors Mareike Uhl, Fabrice Maslia and Laura Hicks. Um, the title of the piece is Twin Hunters Corporation. And the idea is um, that <laughs> it's a kind of funny thing, but you don't remember the day you were born. And then there is um, this idea of, okay, you have uh, twins and maybe the kind of qualities they have in life, they are shared in between those two. Well, the piece is called uh, Stay Hydrated. It's an improvisation piece uh, where we drink water. Uh, and the whole point of it, it started a bit as a joke that uh, what, what ways like how can we um, transform the act of drinking, which is an act that everyone is doing every day, uh, into something else, into something more artistic and maybe more related to sports. We drink an excessive amount on stage and we, yeah, we play with that. So the piece we present is called the Self Portrait. There's this idea that each choreographer needs to have their own solo piece representing them somehow to present yourself to the dance world. <laughs> really, this was my first inspiration to, to, to really push myself to work on a solo. And then it just shifts and it becomes clear in a way that we are there to serve the purpose almost a, of a conference that speaks about him. To show the participants different places in Frankfurt that deal with dance and choreography, we visited the Frankfurt Lab, which serves as a production house and guest venue in Frankfurt. In order to give space to another process state of an artistic work, there were two very exciting work in progress to be seen in the Werkstatt, with an artistic talk afterwards, led by Richard Oberschäfen. In the frame of the former Yes, organized by Fabrice Maslia, Deborah Nerlich and Katja Shiraneva. In the second week, two choreography workshops were happening. One led by Dieter Heidkamp, a choreographer and the director of the BA Dance Program at the University for Music and Performing Arts here in Frankfurt, and one by Kai R. Eng, a graduate of the Choreography and Performance Program at the Justus Liebig University in Gießen. The 
festival closed with two performance evenings at the Gallus Theatre, where the five artists' works were shown. The piece I'm performing, presenting, is called uh, Preservation. Um, so preservation doubles as this way for me to preserve my grandmother's uh, mind and legacy. She was diagnosed with Alzheimer's. I noticed that she started to forget how to cook. So I decided to kind of take on the role of um, continuing and passing on her recipes. And it sort of turned into an integration with my contemporary dance practice. <laughs> The name of the piece is Norm Menu. We kind of summarize um, the topic mainly in normality, the building of the norm and also its failure, and kind of the collapsing of the 90 degree angle. So like the 90 degree angle is kind of like this one of the clearest norms in our society shaping architecture and space and also kind of humans maybe. I am super grateful to be part of this festival, um, to be able to perform it on in, in public, on a stage with amazing technicians and like amazing eyes and feedback and yeah, it's like a launch point, I think. The festival Zukunft Tanz gives us a chance, but at the same time we have a space and we have a certain time frame for it, which is very precious. And it was very hard for the three of us to, to, to meet and, and work. Yeah, just to thank you guys for the invitation. It's very nice and we, we met so much, uh, so much people. It's, no, it's lovely for us to be here and to have this time in the studio. This residency helped us a festival to understanding three sides. Like one as a dancer, one as a city culture, one as working together. Yeah, thank you for that. Yeah, for me it's very nice to, to be here with my team, <laughs> but that we are doing also not just what we do in the West and so and meeting other groups and we will see also other works but together.